What you're seeing is a passenger on a plane who had been so unruly he had to be handcuffed. He makes threats that everybody on the plane's going to die. Uh, he's going to kill everybody. He's going to get it all on video. It was just, it was just out there. Gene Mayhew was behind the man on Continental Flight 84, bound for Tel Aviv. It was the day before Thanksgiving, and Mayhew, a theology professor, was traveling with a small study group. But one passenger, a man from Ireland who was suspected of being intoxicated, was out of control, shoving the seat in front of him and screaming about soccer. We're told flight attendants tried to handcuff him, but he kicked one of them in the knee, and that's when Professor Mayhew jumped. Jumped in, grabbing the man's hood. I grabbed it and I pulled for all my might, and his head went up towards him and boom, back to the two seats, and I had him pinned. Someone else in Mayhew's group was able to videotape some of what happened, and we're told a former Marine sat next to the unruly passenger to try and keep things under control, but then he was hit. And the guy headbutts him hard right into his temple, and the Marine kind of went like that. I mean, just a sucker punch, so to speak, but a headbutt. That's when I grabbed the back of his thing again. I stood up in the aisle, put my foot against his seat, and pulled for all I was worth. The man was reportedly threatening to harm others, and so the pilot had everyone identify their luggage in the overhead compartment so they could locate items the unruly passenger came on board with. And Mayhew says everyone seemed relieved to hear the pilot also say they were diverting to Germany to hand the man over to police. It was definitely post 9-11. Uh, nobody, everybody had their game face on, nobody was going to allow this individual to uh, harm any more people or to do anything. Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News.